We've been getting more questions about the HomeMaster Artesian RO system. Uh, this is their RO that has a remineralization option on it as well. And so we thought we'd take a little, uh, a little deeper in what they've got and share some insights uh, so you can get a good uh, understanding as well. On the main page, you don't get a lot of information. It's very much, uh, pretty much mostly RO focused. Uh, they've got a few things here in the specification section. You know, they have this kind of like whatever copyrighted phrase or whatever mineral water on tap. Um, you get a little mention of down here, the artesian side, added beneficial minerals. Um, but other than that, you don't get much information. You have to go to the replacement filters for the system to get a little bit more insight into the, the artesian filter itself. Uh, and a few things stuck out to us right away. Uh, one is when they mention that cartridge, not only is it remineralization, but you also see there's coconut shell granular activated carbon in there. Don't know how much of each is there yet. We're gonna have to, like I said, cut one open, but that's a bit concerning because your mineral cartridge is not minerals, or at least not all minerals. Um, so that's gonna obviously impact performance. Uh, it's a 10 by two cartridge, so fairly similar to some other ones on the market, but it's, uh, it's significantly smaller than the, the Remin that we'll show you as well. But this is what really stuck out. When you look at, so they have a way to retrofit the system so the water can go through either one time or two times through the, the artesian cartridge anyway. And on the first one, if you just do one time pass through, you get a 15 to 30. If you do two, you get a 30 to 60, at least what they say. And that seems a bit odd. You know, we've been around for a long time and we know that typically when you run water through a mineral bed like this, you get a big increase with the first pass and if you would try to put it back through a second time, you're not going to get anywhere near the same amount of increase. And that's in parts per million of the minerals or pH or ORP. It doesn't matter what you're measuring. The first pass is a big boost. The second is a much more subtle change. So just to double it, because we're going to go through two times, that seems a bit fishy. But again, we're going to have to just cut it open and take a look. Uh, and other than that, there's not much more information. So let's grab one and uh, see what's inside. And here it is in hand. You'll see it's the same filter, the Home Master Modular Artesian filter. Notice the flow direction on there. Uh, that'll be important shortly. Uh, you got three eighths quick connects on both ends and a bit of a pad you can see when you look down in there as well. So we're thinking there's some sort of granular media inside. To do a size comparison, uh, theirs again is 10 inches by two inches. The Vitev Remin is 12 inches by two and a half. So it's a substantial difference in, uh, in volume especially. Uh, do a quick weight check here as well. You don't get one of these clips because of how theirs is installed, but it holds it onto the scale. And theirs is 14 and a half ounces. Uh, so just a shy of a pound. That's not a lot of minerals uh, compared to the Vitev, which is two pounds, 11 ounces. So three times more minerals in the Vitev than the Home Master. All right, so let's cut this open and see what we got inside. Uh, you'll notice quickly that carbon begins to fall out and we can tell we're gonna have a huge mess if we just cut the end off. So we're gonna do a little different method here and crack it like an egg. And just look at how much carbon comes out of this cartridge. I mean, we haven't found a mineral yet. It's carbon, 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 still carbon, until we finally get a few pieces of white that fall out and we know we kind of hit another layer, so we can break it off and, and pour off what's left. And that's it. That's all that's in that filter. This is the same stuff you find in the cheapy Chinese versions. It's 75% carbon and a little bit of calcite thrown on top and calcite is not what we recommend to get your your calcium supplementation via this is much more of a water treatment facility type of calcium than it is a, a human consumption calcium so that artesian filter is a carbon filter with a little bit of very inexpensive calcite tossed in the end